Just listen to that, guys. They're all howling. I dare you to howl, my cue. So this dog's name is River and it was used in a Game of Thrones wedding photo shoot. No, no, no. Oh, tail. my tail. The tail. There oh, it is. There it is. <laughs> it's again. It's still here. Oh, no. Hi. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. What's up? What's going on? I'm talking to you guys too. <laughs> hey guys, what's up, what's going on? So if you haven't been watching my previous vlogs, we are on a trip across North Carolina. We're sponsored by North Carolina Tourism. And today we're going to go to Asheville. We have a lot of crazy events that we're going to be doing today. And these guys are with me, Sarah, Catherine, hi, and Savannah. Hi Savannah. Sun, right? So much sun. Do we have a sunroof in this car? Yeah. Where did the sun go? We are heading to, we're in Asheville to go do a spa. They have some type of salt cave spa here. If you guys don't know, Sarah's channel is all about, how about you, how about you tell the world? Holistic methods, green beauty, trying natural non-toxic methods. So definitely come check out the channel if you guys want to see some stuff. Cool, 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 yeah. cool. And now we're just gonna head on in and see what that's all about. Salt's holistic, right? I think salt's holistic. It's, it's or natural. green. It's natural. Ooh, so look at this. Okay, but like I said, we're gonna bring a bunch of people in here, so um, yeah, maybe don't walk around. That's fine. We could shoot from this side. But yeah, so uh, 20 tons of salt in here. Uh, wow. the water. Hey guys. So uh, we just finished the stuff at the salt cave. They're still in there. I kind of left early. Uh, I get really agitated when I'm like just sitting there doing nothing. I don't really think relaxing is really up my alley, but I know they are for the other girls, so I'm just not, I'm just gonna hang out until they're done. I'm not very good at reviewing those types of things either, so if you want to see a really good review for that, check out Sarah's channel. Uh, she might have a better perspective than I do about what the uh, Salt Cave is all about. You would be the expert in holistic experiences. I passed out and probably had five different dreams. That's never happened before. Really? Yeah. Okay, let's go eat some barbecue. Do you guys like barbecue? So we're at this place, it's on uh, the River District, or the River Arts District in uh, Asheville. And the idea was that we are going to be going, check out some graffiti in the area, as well as this barbecue place. Is a, oh, shoot, shoot, sorry. This barbecue place is apparently one of the best barbecue places in the state. Okay, right now we're at 12 Bones. This is a barbecue place. Obama's visited here twice. This place looks absolutely amazing. They have graffiti outside all the walls. Uh, and it is crazy busy packed in here. If you guys haven't heard, for Canadians, the rule is if there's ever a patio. It is a rule. It's I always been a rule. I never heard of it. I never heard of it. Everybody in Toronto says this. <laughs> Everybody except those. <laughs> she's not from Toronto and she's from what? Nova Scotia. <laughs> Guys, this is what Obama ordered. We oh crushed it. It's amazing. If anyone that comes in just tags things. No, because the thing is, these guys, since they're w so well respected, people don't mess with it. Oh wow! Oh, so okay. they they're like, you know, they got a lot of street cred, so they, people don't people don't come and tag over it. Yeah. Guys, since this gave me this, we're gonna try cooking with this when we get back in Toronto. I'm really excited because you know, this, this, this food has been amazing. Jesus Christ. Thanks, man. Thanks, man. This, Thanks, is, man. this, this sure. is an awesome Come place. Come back again sometime. We will. We will. So we're gonna take some Instagram photos of all the different graffiti here. Sarah's gonna be our model. Hey. I'm gonna try. Thank I don't you. model though. Thank you. Thank you for being the model. <laughs> yeah. I'll so do. check out Sarah's channel or my channel on Instagram to see some of the shots. But some of the graffiti here is absolutely amazing. All right, here we go. We're gonna start. I'm gonna change plans. So what else is on your bucket list of things to do? 
skydiving license would be cool. Get a motorcycle license, that's on my bucket list this year. Cool. Um, parasailing would be fun. I've actually never ziplined. So, really? Yeah, no, I've never ziplined. Oh. I was going to say, I think for me, I'm more interested in learning things than doing things. Mm. She's a learner. She's a learner. I should get you signed up on one of those paint classes. 400 meters! Guys, I'm so excited! This is my dream. This is actually a bucket list right here. All right. Dog sanctuary. Dog sa wolf dog sanctuary. We're gonna be, okay, so I don't think I've explained this yet. So right now we are in the mountains of uh, North Carolina, near Ashenville, about an hour out. Uh, and we are going to a wolf dog sanctuary where we're gonna be meeting some of the dogs that may have been on the set of Game of Thrones. So, dire wolves. Basically, we're meeting dire wolves. If you don't like that, please go away. That's cute. Wolf crossing. God! That's crazy. Oh my god, the puppies! So, those are wolves, not dogs, right? They're wolf dogs. <gasps> Look at the puppies! Oh god. Look at the. Oh! Oh my god, I'm dying. Okay, I'm gonna show you what they're screaming Hi, about. Jeez, uh. They're amazingly majestic. They're very majestic. Let's go. <laughs> Guys, wait. Can I need to Instagram this really quick? Are they oh my dangerous? gosh. <gasps> They're all howling. Oh. Sorry, I need so to. What, I need so to it's a this. combination of like dogs and wolves. Wait, hold on. I am dying right now. We are at a wolf dog sanctuary. So this is where a couple of dogs that were in Game of Thrones they got them from here, and there's like. Wolf dogs right there! Hi puppies! I sorry, you're gonna hear a lot of like of my dog voice, but seriously these dogs are Okay so guys, so before you go to the wolf dog sanctuary, the tourism board actually told us that you definitely need to book an appointment in advance. You can't just show up here, but we are gonna do that right now. Are you guys ready? Yeah. Yeah, I'm yes. Good. Okay, let's go. Hello, hello, hello. Nancy, is there you Nancy? Yes, I'm Nancy. Nice to meet Pleasure you. Pleasure to meet you, Mike you. Uh, Savannah and they're still up. The movie, yeah. uh, the TV show, the models for that were wolf dogs from another facility out west. What we did is we shot a um, make-believe wedding at a castle up in Spruce Pine. So we took River, and you'll end up the tour meeting River, um, and we, we took him up there for this Game of Thrones shoot, and he played a dire wolf, and it kind of went um, viral. Come over here. What? What? No, we can't come and play with you. Baby flies. He was owned by a man. Kisses. Oh. Good kisses. Our product of a wolf dog to wolf dog breeding or a wolf dog to, to dog breeding. Thank three you. or more Good generations kisses. removed from the pure wolf. And the pure wolf is a captive bred wolf. They're the wolves that have been used in um, movies and mm -hmm. Hollywood. Um, they're tractable, trainable, and tame. They're still wild animals taxonomically, but yeah. personality-wise, they're pretty close to domesticated. They're mm -hmm. not domesticated. A domesticated wolf is a dog. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> they, wolves and dogs are also the same species. So listen to that, guys. They're all howling. Just turned 10, April wow. 19th. Ah, ah, ah. You know better than that. Just kisses. Speaking of hating me. <laughs> this is insane. Oh. Hi, Aries. There's this fence here because it's for insurances, if anyone's wondering. So we can't go super up close. Yeah. She can be a little mouthy, but she sees oh, the cats. Oh, she's, she's a little hesitant. Could be the hat, could be the microphone. Oh. 
she's very sweet. Um, oh, I may consider placing her in a home. She has, she's attacked a smaller animal and she's female on female aggressive. She could never go where there's a female animal. Cute. He is what we call a high content, him and Aries. Um, not many dog hairs in there. So he it's came, mainly wolf. He, um, yeah, he's, he's mainly wolf. Okay. He has some socialization skills. Um, he likes people when you're in there with him and he likes ladies. The fact that he's not running off is great. Yeah. He's, he's watching, he's posing for you. Yeah. The female behind him is a true Arctic mix. There aren't that many Arctics out there. Hey. Oh yeah, you are. Get over here. Mama gonna whip your butt. I think it's like the microphone. The animal that was in here <laughs> lost her. It starts. Mom, they'll talk to you through the fence. They're wonderful. Hello. Then you can pet them. Yes. D'Artagnan is a dilute blue. They're Hello. wolf dogs. Very low content. More dog than wolf. But if you look at the color of his black on his back and hers, so he's the fourth musketeer. Oh, <laughs> cute. cute. I have a pretty good name. That is a good name. No, that's a the dog. The orange one is my pet. Okay. She is my house dog. Hi, River. She loves River more than me. It's Ow, River. She's your mom. Hi, River. All right, so this dog's name is River, and it was used in a Game of Thrones wedding photo shoot. No, no, no. Oh, where did her dog go? Hi, River. What is she doing? She's trying to How have you been? Oh. Yep, she'll come up and T-bone him. <laughs> That's why so many Rob Wilders are named Tank. She is brutal. River. River. So we're learning a lot of different facts about wolf dogs here today. And the fact is that a lot of the people that sell wolves or sell wolf dogs, they're not actually wolf dogs at all. This is actually where Nancy's come and protects the wolf dogs. They're all volunteers here, and they run strictly on donations. Uh, I don't think I've ever been to somewhere like this before. It's absolutely stunning. Hey, you. How are you doing? That's so playful. Jump up again. See, my background's in horses. And you've got a horse that's a jumper. That's what you do is you flip them over back. Yeah. I know you want to Easy. jump. Easy. Oh, like, oh tail. my tail. The tail. <laughs> there oh, it is. There it is. <laughs> it's again. It's still here. Oh, no. <laughs> Not electric, so yeah. you should be able to cut it. Thank you, Nancy. All right. Thank, Thank you for you. all the lovely time. <laughs> okay. Really appreciate it. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you. Thank oh. you. And thank, thank you. you. Nice to meet you, darling. This is the Full Moon Sanctuary, and basically they run off donations and volunteer work. So if you want to volunteer and meet direwolves and have fun with dogs all day, uh, it is a lot of hard work, but it, everything that they're doing here is absolutely amazing. Uh, we have to rush off now because we're heading off to dinner, but we're going to, it's about an hour drive back into town, so we're going to go now. Right now, how's the road trip, everybody? What's up? What's going on? Road trip's good. Yeah. I feel very zoned out today with like all the spa and the dogs. Oh wait, wait, wait! That was the road. That was the road. Guys, we're eating Indian food tonight. That on the side, yeah. and then um, with the mixed vegetables pop. Yeah. Some fresh chips. Yay! Let's do this. These are called Oprah fries. Oprah fries. Oprah fries. Let's do it. Okay, well done. That was a lot of food. Welcome to my room, guys. Okay, guys, so that's the end of today's vlog. Thank you guys for watching. Remember to like and subscribe. And, you know, I've, I've just arrived back from the um, restaurant, and the restaurant was amazing. But I am so exhausted. And I think I have itis right now, so I'm probably going to go into deep sleep. Uh, otherwise, I'll see you guys next time, and thank you guys for watching. Bye, guys.